Hello everyone, Ace here, and today we are once again testing out the Steam Deck, and this time seeing how it handles Dwarf Fortress, or more specifically, the recently released Steam version of Dwarf Fortress. Now, as you can see here, I'm going to be using the default settings to see how the game handles it from a frame rate perspective. Although that is not the only thing that needs to be brought up, because this is Dwarf Fortress we're talking about, so I also believe it is important to discuss how the controls handle on the Steam Deck, as Dwarf Fortress is a pretty complex game after all. Fortunately, there is some good news, at least at the start, because the game does actually run right out of the box. Although the frame rate is likely going to take a dip as your fortress expands and gets considerably larger. Mine that you see here is of course still fairly early on, as you can tell by the low population. So naturally, I wouldn't exactly be surprised if it turned out that this game took a bit of a frame rate dip late game. Still, at least this isn't a game that is as dependent on frame rate as a lot of other games out there. On the subject of controls, however, I have been rather pleasantly surprised. Don't get me wrong, it is still a little bit on the clunky side to get things done with the Steam Deck controller. However, I have noticed that the developers have made some improvements already, as I've already seen some pretty significant changes as far as the controls for the Steam Deck. So someone is definitely taking time out of their day to make sure that this game runs as pleasantly as possible on the Steam Deck, at least as far as controls are concerned. So while there may be some frame rate problems late game currently, I do actually think that this is definitely a game worth trying out on the Steam Deck at the very least. Now admittedly, the gameplay that is on screen is probably not going to be that riveting because A, I'm not that experienced at Dwarf Fortress, and B, Dwarf Fortress should be seen in a similar vein as Minecraft, except on crack. So while there's plenty of interesting things to talk about in the game, you also run a very good chance of just having some very comfy gameplay footage as you can see in the background. So with all of that said, I think it's a good time to wrap this up. So uh, yeah, this has been Ace. Hope to see you guys again soon. Take care. Ace out.